right guys thanks for tuning in to another video i just finished riding if you watched the last video this is the same day and everything um this is the accessory video every accessory you should have while owning a jet ski um the first thing you should have is a jet ski here is mine just finished cleaning it and drying it it is a 2023 sea gtx 230 um i'm almost done with the braking period i'm at 4.8 out of 5 hours but uh, let's get into the accessories you should have obviously the first one would be a jet ski the second thing you should have are cleaning supplies right so what I recommend you get is soap I got this from West Marine it's marine soap ocean friendly I guess um, this is a foam gun foam king is the one I use but I probably would recommend getting a better one I got that off Amazon it doesn't really it, it works but uh there are better ones out there um a mitt a wash mitt get those anywhere Walmart a chamois to dry it um a hose obviously to wash it um and if you ride in salt water <coughs> excuse me another thing you would need is salt away so that's, that's that blue stuff in there <coughs> It does exactly what the name is. Flushes the salt out. Keeps your, you know, exhaust and all that stuff. Your system salt free so the salt doesn't eat it up. You can even spray the jet ski down with this, which I recommend. I ride in strictly salt water, so I would get the salt away. You can get it on Amazon. Um, get the kit. It comes with this piece as well. Um, and then get yourself a two-foot hose with a male and a female end. So that's mandatory um next i recommend is an anchor so i just grabbed this anchor it's called um sand shark i just used it for the first time if you watch my last video you'll see it it's uh it works pretty well my cousin has another um anchor i think it's from wave rx or something that one works oh, probably better than this one but this still does the job i think it was like 90 bucks on amazon um also have yourself a anchor rope or any kind of rope i have one with a cab carabiner on the end and a uh, regular dock tie i guess you'd call it this is seven feet but it expands into 14 feet another thing you guys should have on your ski is dock ropes so there's same thing just smaller so you can use them to tie up I just got these off Amazon brand new for this year. Same thing. Carabiner on one end. Then you just tie it to your jet ski with the other. Or actually put this side on the dock and put that side on your jet ski. Yeah, I got a two-pack of those. Those are always good to have also. Obviously have a life vest. I just washed this so it's all wet, drying right now. Um, more importantly, I would have a uh, dry bag. Um, this is a 20 liter dry bag. I got it off Amazon. I get everything off Amazon. Um, it just keeps everything dry that you want to keep dry. I have to keep a towel, sunscreen, uh, maybe a, a shirt in there. Um, because the inside of the jet ski is pretty much waterproof, but some water does get in. And uh, in case you have, you know, you, you sink, got to bit or anything like that, you, you just grab that and you go with floats and everything. So, also a jet ski cover. There's mine right here. I always get the OEM, $300 cover. I got it included with my jet ski though. They hooked me up. So yeah, what else? Am I missing anything? Oh, I have a good pair of riding glasses. I use these, uh, they're called C-Specs. I got them off Amazon. That or find a good pair of goggles. Um, these are good for the wind. They don't really prevent water from really getting into your eyes that good, but it helps with the wind. Um, when you're driving so also oh yeah i almost forgot water shoes amazon again Get yourself a good pair of water shoes try to think if there's, if there's anything else oh bumpers i don't have them installed on the ski yet i mean fenders but they're coming soon there are i'll show you a picture of them boom they just go over the side of the ski so when you tie up to a dock it doesn't bounce off the, the ski it bounces off the bumper so sort of like how the boat has that thing in the water same thing but just for a jet ski and if you have the specific ski or um, a 300 or any of those these um, bigger sea dews 
I'd recommend getting this thing. Um, it's like 40 bucks on Amazon. You just three screws, the holes are pre-drilled. Takes five minutes to install and it makes everything very convenient. I keep my drink in there. I got sunscreen, snacks, or whatever you wanna, uh, whatever you wanna get. Uh, also, make sure you have your Coast Guard kit. You know, it comes with the whistle and all that good stuff. And a fire extinguisher. You need those to Rhode Island at least, probably everywhere else as well. Um, but yeah, you need that. What else? Oh, also speakers, obviously. I came with the speakers, Bluetooth. But if you ain't got speakers, figure it out because it makes a world of a difference. Obviously, a trailer you need, which you should already, I mean, should buy it with a jet ski to have one. I'm trying to think, is there anything else I'm forgetting? A GoPro, like I'm using right now, I got the chest mount right over there where I get majority of my angles for my riding. And uh, I think that is all. Oh, also, obviously, maybe you want to help out my brand, the Hustle brand. We have t-shirts, um, sweatsuits, a whole bunch of stuff, hats. Just go on to the hustlebrand.com. It's the first link in the description and check it out. And if you like something, snag it. I don't charge uh, a million bucks for my items. I make them very reasonable. I make a small profit and uh, it's just a good hobby for me. So thank you guys for tuning into another video. I really appreciate it. The channel is growing by the day. Um, if there's anything you want to ask or for me to cover, just please you know comment down in the comment section below i love chatting with you guys um whether you have jet skis sea dudes uh or yamaha jet ski or boats whatever uh i just like to get out here so i like uh pretty much vlogging so thanks for tuning in i appreciate it i'll catch you guys in the next one peace